from U.S. Army Staff Sergeant Travis Mills. Travis has a truly inspiring story. He's one of only five uh, quadruple amputees who have served in Iraq and Afghanistan and survived those injuries. It, it's, it's really, it's an amazing story. You're going to, you'll walk away inspired. Uh, he's funny, he's entertaining, he's really just a terrific guy. And then please help me welcome U.S. Army Staff Sergeant Travis Mills. Wow, hey, how's everybody doing today? Thank you, thank you for having me. Thank you for coming out. As you saw in the trailer, my name is Staff Sergeant Travis Mills, formerly of the 82nd Airborne Division, United States Army. On April 10th, 2012, believe it or not, I zigged when I should have zagged. I took the wrong step. I made one slight error and set my bag down in an explosion, and my arms and legs disappeared. It's okay, though. It's okay, because these doctors at Walter Reed made them reappear. I was woken up on my 25th birthday to find out I was still alive. Hey Travis, happy 25th birthday. You're in Germany, you're a quadruple amputee, and you don't get to have cake today. Oh man, shucks. He came walking in my room, and I'm waking up for the first time, kind of sore, a little groggy, and he comes walking in. Hi, I'm Todd. I'm like, whoa, am I dreaming? Look at this monster of a robot here. He's like a transformer with a pretty face. So I'm going to ask some questions now, kids, if you, and I want you to be interactive here. What motivates you? Who likes pizza? Pizza motivates me, but what motivates me more is actually cheesecake. I love it. Can't get enough of it. Six weeks or seven weeks after my explosion, I actually was able to take my first steps around the track. It was, it was just life-changing. How wild is it that a guy with no arms, no legs can run? I'm not very fast, but I guarantee if you're sitting in a chair and I say, right, you set, go, and you stay sitting, I'm going to beat you in a race. Hands down, I guarantee I'll beat you if you stay sitting. So I need two volunteers to come up on stage. Who's not shy? Right here, right here, your arm went up. Come on up here, little lady. Whoa, ha! You're doing it. Good job, good job. And that's how it works, ladies and gentlemen. So if I put my hand up slow, I flex the muscle slow. If I flex it fast, it rotates to the left. Push it back in real hard. Twist. Push it, twist. Ah, put it on the table. Don't worry about it. I'll get it later. So when I started out, you guys saw when I was walking with my daughter, it was a short leg. You start there so you get your hips. Because all my balance now is in my hips, and believe it or not, my core. It's pretty strong underneath all that cheesecake. With the arms, it stays the same. Uh, only thing is I get the sweet carbon look, and uh, I look sleek and slim, you know, because black is slimming, of course. I think it's wonderful that there's such an initiative to help the wounded warriors and veterans out there, and I think it's great if you serve. Thank you for your service. If you support the troops, thanks for that. The great thing for me is that I'm not wounded. I'm just a guy with scars. I'm here to tell you I'm not a sob story. I'm a story of resilience. I'm just a guy getting get by for my family, you know what I mean? On top of that, if you guys get bored, check out travismills.org. It's a great website. It tells my whole story. It has a documentary um, uh, trailer, and you guys can keep up with what I'm doing. And uh, if you guys want to go skydiving someday, let me know. <laughs> 